Hello everyone, welcome back to this YouTube channel. I am Preeti. In this today's video tutorial, I am going to explain about how we can publish an agent to a live or demo website in Microsoft Copilot Studio. In my previous video, I have already explained like how we can create an agent in Microsoft Copilot Studio. If in case you missed it, then I will provide the video link in the description box below. You can overlook it. So like recently, we created an agent uh, like called uh, Employee Leave Management agent uh, for our one of our client where uh, like uh, they wanted to publish that agent somewhere like in some site page or website where uh, their users can directly access that web link and they can uh, like uh, uh, like they can start the conversation with the chat board so for that reason uh, like uh, I have done that and uh, for that reason I have uh, thought like uh, I will share with you guys also so that you will get some knowledge on it. So let's get started with this. So first of all we should know what is the live and demo website in Copilot Studio. A live website for actual production like helping customers on your support page you should publish the agent on your live website so make sure before uh, like uh, sending the web link or something you should publish your agent so that it will uh, like uh, update in uh, to your users a live website is a website that is accessible to the public on the internet okay and demo website means it is for trying purpose suppose you have created one agent and you want to try out the demo like how it is uh, like how it is functioning so to test the copilot's agent you can share with uh, share it with your teammates or others those who want to try it out it's not meant for the real customer use that means it is like uh, like if you want to try it out that agent then you can use the demo website directly we can create a demo website and we can create uh, like uh, we can copy that uh, demo website link and we can share with the users so that using that web link they can access and they can start conversation with the chat board so this is all about the live and demo website in copilot studio now we will see how we can publish it in live and as well as demo website in copilot studio so let's move ahead to the microsoft copilot so uh, open your copilot studio by using this my copilot studio dot microsoft dot com like this one this is the link where you can uh, provide your microsoft credential and it will open and here you can see this is the home page and here you can see all the agent you can publish the agent once you create it after creating the agent you can publish somewhere so that other users can use it so uh, like uh, first of all we will see how we can publish the agent in live website so i have created uh, so i want to um uh, i want to live this agent in my sharepoint site page one of my sharepoint site page so for that one just click on this agent option over here and then here you can see all my agents over here isn't i will take uh, called it help this so here you can see in this it help this that is used to uh like uh, it helps to user to uh, get all the uh, get details uh like uh if you ask like uh, what is my current status it will give you the status from the any data source like that so this one i will take and i will publish make sure you need to publish this agent like uh, before uh, uh, like publishing in any site okay to publish uh, this agent in a live site i will uh, like i i will create a serpent site page and i will embed it for that reason just uh, like uh, go to channels so inside the channels uh, you can see there will be web app okay so click on that so here it will be embed code you need to copy this embed code okay suppose in case you can't see this embed code over here like this embed code some cases it is not visible in that uh, like in that case what you will do go to settings and uh, inside the settings there will be security and uh, inside the under the security there will be authentication so in authentication you need to choose this option no authentication and then click on save then only like once you will come back to this agent you can see on uh, like after that that uh, embed code will be visible over here so just click on this channel go to this web app uh, to publish in a live website so just click on this and then copy this uh, embed code so once it copied to the clipboard 
then you need to go to a sharepoint uh, site or a site page where you can show that uh, agent uh, like publicly so here uh, just go to the site content uh, like uh, here and then click on site page to create a new site page uh, also you can add this agent or embed this agent to the existing site also but here i want to create a new website like a site page so i will just click on the new and then you need to provide the title over here so as it is a uh, it help desk so i can write here in the title i can write it help desk both okay and then here in under this one like uh, like you can add a any type of section so i want to add in one column so here you can click on uh, this uh, plus icon over here to add the embed of web part so you can see you can search like you can search the embed of part over here if you can't find it you can just search it and then you can find the embed web part and then you need to provide that code over here okay that embed code so once you will click on that uh, copied uh, like uh, embed code you can see in the right side it is loading here that uh, agent will appear in some cases what is happening like while embedding in this code uh, one error is coming embedding content from this website is not allowed but your admin can change these settings so what you need to do you need to try a parameter called copilotstudio.microsoft.com into the html field security that is uh, present under the site collection administrator so i will tell you uh, like uh, you i have uh, a detailed tutorial like uh, where you can see all the details and also i have described like uh, how you can resolve this error just you need to go to the settings then view all site setting and under the site collection administration there will be html field security and then you need to add the copilotstudio.microsoft.com and then click on okay so once it, once it is done you just come back to the site page and then you can embed your uh, code and once you embed this code you can see uh, like it is coming like you just need to publish it once you will publish it you can see that it help text uh, like uh, agent is uh, appearing over your uh, site page so here you can see so like uh, you also you can uh, like uh, if you want to share this link then you can share this link to other users or your teammates like once you uh, share it they can also uh, like uh, just uh, um, open this web link in the browser and they can start using it so if i will ask like hi then if you'll say hi then it will reply so if i will ask what is about this boat then you can see it will like reply me so directly you can converse you can start your conversation uh, directly on the page so this is how we can publish an agent in a live website or sharepoint site page so here you can see everything he explained very well like it help is a virtual assistant desire to enter customer support and reduce its it support volumes so here you can see how we can use in the live website next comes to how we can use it in the in our uh, demo website for that one you can see same way you need to come to this channel and uh, then you need to click on this demo website so once you click on this demo website you can see one is welcome message second one is conversation starters and the third one is share your website so first one uh, the welcome message it will uh, like introduce your agent and its purpose to your team member so so here i will write something like try out this it help desk by asking some queries okay and then conversion starters you can write hi and good morning like this you can add and then here you can uh, write what is this boat you will write it what is this boat i will show you how we can, how uh, it is displaying in the website or demo website and then share your website you can invite your team members to see your agent in this section so just need to click on copy so it is copied to the clipboard and then just click on save now what will happen once you save it you can see the channel was saved 
and then once you'll open in a new window and paste this link it will appear like this so here you can see your demo website is ready where you can see these are the conversation starters so directly you can click on this once you will click on hi it will uh, reply you how i can help you today and what is this about if you will click on this like it will again tell you what is the purpose of creating this bot and uh, uh, how you can uh, how uh, it is useful for us okay so you can see this is our uh, demo website so in this way we can publish our agent copilot agent in uh, uh, live website and as well as the demo website also i have written a full article in spguides.com you can see uh, so you can visit this tutorial also i will provide this tutorial link in the description box below you can, oh, and you can overlook it so if you really like this video kindly like share and subscribe to our youtube channel for more videos like this thank you and have a nice day